Tonight's sports report is sponsored by National University. Not for profit, all for students. Learn more at nu.edu. For the third time in just over a year, an NFL franchise is abandoning local fans for the promise of a new stadium in a different city. First, the Rams went from St. Louis to LA, then the Chargers joined them. And today, NFL owners at their league meeting in Phoenix approved the move of the Raiders from Oakland to Las Vegas. But they'll be pulling off the Band-Aid slowly in the East Bay, with the Raiders planning to still call Oakland home for the next two years, while a $1.7 billion stadium is built just off the Las Vegas Strip. This is becoming such old hat for the NFL that Commissioner Roger Goodell simply dusted off the same platitudes, and I mean the exact same platitudes, he used a couple of months ago when talking about San Diego. See if this sounds familiar. We're particularly disappointed for the fans. We work very hard and never want to see a relocation of a franchise. Uh, that means exhausting our options and doing everything we possibly can to get a solution in the existing market. And this has been an issue uh, for well over a decade. We also, uh, the owners put an additional $100 million, unprecedented, uh, $300 million total to try to find that solution. And we worked as tirelessly and as hard as we could to try to find that solution. And we just couldn't get that done. It's like deja vu. The vote to approve the move from went 31 to 1 with only the Dolphins voting no. And even for San Diego area Raiders fans who might be excited the team is moving a little closer, nothing about the relocation of an NFL team feels very good. Well, one week from today, the Padres open the regular season in L.A. against the Dodgers. They look pretty ready today, facing their Peoria neighbors, the Seattle Mariners. Well, Myers blasted a two-run homer in the first inning off Giovanni Gallardo. The ball was carrying well to that part of the ballpark. Later on in the inning, Ryan Schimpf puts one in the same place. Padres up 4-0. Then in the fifth inning, Jabari Blash belted his seventh home run of the spring. The Padres went on to a 12-2 win. So I know I felt sympathy for all the fans up in Oakland mm -hmm. today because we've yeah. gone through this. We just yeah. did it. I was right. going to say, group therapy might not be a bad <laughs> idea if you can get those fan bases together. Yeah, historically, That's... the NFL didn't want to be close to gambling. Times really have changed. Yeah, well, I guess $750 million in public money changed their mind. Public money yeah. sure does. Thanks, Ben.